Hello. Henry, I think a very good touch would be for you to get Otis Chandler on the phone and tell him that you thought his questions were very perceptive and sensitive. And the president thought that, that you would just chat it with me and then he, about youth and the rest. I'll do that. Give him a little crap right now. You know? I'll do that. He'll love it. Actually, he was all right. He was good, you know. He smiled. And he's, a, he's really... A, a decent man, really. That's right. I wonder very really, well. I'll get the, the White House. Well, yeah, no, just call the White House and tell him he's at the Shoreham. Right. And for them to get him for you and tell him you're, get, you're calling for the president. And they'll right. get him. Good. I'll right. do it this minute. Actually, uh, you know, uh, this little performance night was, wasn't much, but basically... These uh, editors, they uh, they had to hear. I mean, I couldn't give them the thing they wanted to hear. Recognize Red China, admit them to the United Nations, UK. give them a, give them a deadline with regard to this and that. No, and you notice what I said about residual forces that we're not going to have a residual. I was very subtle about that. I said not like Korea, but we're going to keep a residual force as long as is necessary to see Vietnam can defend itself. I would trust now after I finished with you. Uh, talked to Adlai Stevenson Jr. Did you? Yeah, and he said, you know, in foreign... I defended him, you know. I beg your pardon? Tonight I defended him. I said it was a terrible thing that they they bugged him, you know, during the convention. Uh, he said you won hands down on foreign policy tonight. He did? Yeah. <laughs> and I didn't ask him what he thought because I didn't want to embarrass him. Yeah. That's good. Well, you call Otis Chandler and say that the president thought his questions were excellent. You tell him you thought his questions were excellent. You just talk to the president. He thought he was, thought he really zeroed in on what really people were worried about, which is really true, Henry. They're worried about kids. You know, and what I said about kids, you and I know that they're not worth a damn. But, no, but the on the other hand, I did say that, look, if we bring peace and, and if, if we clean up the environment and the rest, and the kids may think maybe the system ain't all that bad, huh? Well, you weren't saying anything, Mr. President, that this isn't true. Whatever one thinks of some of the reactions, you define the problem. I think you should call him immediately, okay? I'll call, I'll call him this minute, Mr. Mm -hmm. President.